Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is my fastback project. I'm getting ready to convert this coupe over to a fastback. I got most of the uh, rear interior out, which you can see over in here. Most of the rear interior out. Carpet. Pick this up. This is a 68, but I'm going to use, I got the uh, center console out sitting over here. It's a center, center console here. But basically here's all my parts. Got the quarter panel, um, tons of stuff. I'm not gonna explain all the parts that I got. However, this is going to be the 68 conversion to a fastback. I'm gonna be doing everything solo myself. In this garage, that's the uh, 69 Cougar, which is for sale. But basically, I got the uh, 60 gallon air compressor. I got the uh, Lincoln 140 MIG welder. That's my um, Argon CO2 mix, 75% Argon, 25% CO2. So a lot of people, when they do these conversions, they take all of this stuff out. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna take the two front seats out so I can get the carpet out of here, but I'm gonna just mask off my door panels on both sides. I'm gonna uh, mask off the dash area, starting with the dash pad, you know, in and around the uh, steering wheel. I'm gonna leave all of that stuff in because it's just gonna give me less stuff to reassemble once I'm all done. But as you can see, this car needs tons of body work. However, the reason why I bought it is because the guy basically redid everything under the hood. All brand new everything. This is the original carburetor, which basically has a leak. It's, leak, it's leaking out of this hole up top right here, um, which I'm probably going to end up putting a 351 stroker in here. This is the original 289. It's been rebuilt. The engine run flawlessly. Just got an issue with that carburetor. I got the original air cleaner right there, 289 air cleaner. But this engine bay looks freaking brand new. Like he redid everything. I'm talking about, you know, master cylinder, booster, uh, rebuilt the engine, rebuilt the transmission. If I showed you underneath the car, the, underneath the car it looks just as new as this. All new shock springs, um, leaf springs, um, gas tank, gas line, brake lines. I mean, he, he went through this thing. So it's a good candidate to actually convert into the fastback. So this is the project that I'm taking on. Already got the molding around, around the windshield out. That's gotta come out. So does the rear glass. So this is the first day of disassembling. And so far, this is where I'm at. It's in the process of removing the uh, tail lights got to get the um, back bumper off as well this uh, I was going to keep this on here the rear tail light panel but as you can see it's got some damage right there so that's why I'm gonna cut that off too so I got to find out where all of the spot wells are and get this out without removing this piece here because I want to keep this as a reference so when I line up my new tail light panel uh, everything goes in well so that's where I'm at I'm going to keep you guys updated to the progress but I'm doing this right at home in my garage just to encourage those who might think that this is a daunting task I'm not a welder I'm not a body guy I'm planning on painting the car doing everything myself so I'm gonna keep you guys updated let you know how it goes thanks for tuning in don't for forget to hit the like button and hit the subscribe button to keep new videos alerts coming your way thank you